Now to the unsolved murder case of a Southwest Houston woman. The investigation lasting almost eight years now. 20 year old Shelby Thornburg was found dead in her apartment. Her throat had been slashed. Yeah, her killer never was identified despite surveillance video. Police say it shows him walking out of the apartment complex. Here's KPRC 2's Bill Barajas. On November 4th, 2015, Shelby Thornburg was brutally murdered here at her Southwest Houston apartment complex. HPD says the killer, after meeting Shelby through an escort website, was in and out of the complex in less than 20 minutes. It's a quick clip, just a few seconds long. The man walking to the lobby is who HPD believes is behind Shelby Thornburg's murder. Over the years, the video has been analyzed, watched over and over by know, Shelby's big sister, hard, Christina Scott. Now, the more I look at it, the more I study it, it just angers me. Like, how could he be so casually just nonchalant about everything? Shelby was found dead here in her third floor apartment. Scott says she was a small town girl who came to Houston hoping to be a model. Shelby was a very loving, very kind, very generous, generous person. Unfortunately, Scott says she got mixed up with the wrong people. I had known for quite a, quite some time that Shelby had a back page. She kept telling me she wasn't prostituting. She wasn't doing nothing nasty with nobody. She was just going out on dates with rich people who were looking for that companionship for big parties. And so she had just not too recently moved in here. Detective Dustin Crowder has been on the case since the beginning. He's followed up on numerous tips over the years. He came into the apartment after texting her on her on um, the burner phone that he was here. He had to be let in to her to the elevator, I believe at the time. And then I think it was only in there for 17 minutes. So in 17 minutes he managed, we believe, to have intercourse um, and kill her, clean up and then leave the apartment. Crowder says even the FBI assisted in the case. Their analysis unit concluded that there was a likelihood that this guy was a serial killer based on the factors of who the victim was and, and how meticulous he was at concealing his identity. And HPD says based on the information they have gathered, they do not believe the killer is from the Houston area. If you have any information on the man seen in that video, you're asked to call the Houston Police Department immediately and report it. In Southwest Houston, Bill Barajas, KPRC 2 News. All right, Bill, thank you.